Mr. Jose Campos from uh, Van Grau Dairy in uh, Visaya, California. We're just having a discussion regarding uh, the number of samples that you want to want to try and take to be able to get a good read on the on the dry dry matter of the corn silage coming in. Just this uh, pile just started up this morning. Tell me a little bit about what your sampling technique has been. Well, you know, since we start the fields in the morning, um, we um, start taking samples. Uh, I take. Uh, on each truck, one one from each field every 50 minutes, and then uh, you know I I dehydrate it 50 minutes on the cost of the dehydrators, and then we take maximum of 10 or 11 samples of uh, corn silage, and then uh, we average the fields, you know, one by one, and we go from there on our dry matters. So in, since about 8 o'clock this morning when they started chopping, you've got accumulated how many samples total? I got total so far, uh, right now I got about 10 samples on each field. And there's two fields? Yes, two fields right okay, now. Okay, so and you've pulled 20 samples from this one day's harvest so yes, far. Yes, exactly. And the average uh, dry matter on this you got is? Right now it's 35. 35 point, uh, 66. Okay. Almost 36 dry matter. All right, yes. and 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 the dairy uh, owner and uh, and yourself and the and the uh, nutritionist had set a target at, at what level? Uh, yes, uh, our our target is 35 dry right matter. Okay, so you're running right uh, within. Yeah, right on the right on the spot, right on the right on the money. Yeah. Ah, congratulations. Yeah. Thank you very much. All right, thank you very much, Jose. Yeah, thank you.